This video is to describe the project associated with Introduction to Engineering Practice. The project is organized in conjunction with Engineers Without Borders, an organization which identifies such projects around the world. Students will design a report based on research into a design area at a chosen place within the world and the place that has been chosen for UWS College is the community of Bambui in Cameroon. Here is a typical scene in Bambui and it's quite clear the needs of the area in terms of water, sanitation, transport and many other services and features which people in the Western world enjoy. There is a map showing the location of Bambui in Cameroon. Further details of the area and the surrounding rural district will be provided by Engineers Without Borders. Here is a scene near the water source in Bambui. There are crops growing in the fields. There is a typical sanitation problem. Cooking. Growing food. And congestion and the state of the roads. These are some of the areas of concern and areas where students will be researching and basing their reports. So, pure water, sanitation, hygiene, alternative energy, food preservation, road congestion. These are just some of the many possibilities in the area of Cameroon that we are going to focus on. Students will start by identifying their project and writing an executive summary of their project and then they'll produce a problem statement. Initial presentations and reports will then follow and then an extensive analysis of all the data and research will be used to form the final report. This is a team report and a team presentation which is delivered in the final week of the unit, that's week 10. And then a reflective assessment is carried out at the end of the unit called Project Brief. So students initially, initially start in teams of four. They select a project and a topic for each team member. They'll acquire the skills of working as a team, presenting, writing, designing, drawing. And the aim is to solve a real sustainable engineering problem using a systems approach. You will liaise with Engineers Without Borders and with college staff and follow the unit learning guide. The full report is similar, has a similar format to a business report and the team will share the preparation of the report and its compilation and delivery. So the first oral presentation week four followed by the first project report and then the final reports in week 10. Week nine is when you will carry out your report brief. Thank you.